I remember when I was in the water and that current is really strong. And I'll never forget, I got a little tired. I had this moment of, of inflection. I'm saying, wow, here I am in the middle of the Detroit River and now I'm reflecting that I have a cancer diagnosis. I, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I mean, I was training for what was going to be my first triathlon, and then the news came. And so I said, well, here I am now at 62, and I said, I'm diagnosed with colon cancer. So the competition was on that Sunday of the same week. I've invested too much time and energy to stop in this race. And I transferred that, that discipline, that, that, that focus, into my cancer recovery. Because I know there are a lot of people who have received this diagnosis who didn't make it. But guess what? I'm not gonna let this cancer diagnosis stop me. faith in God, and I was going to leverage my faith to fight this battle. I feel so inspired to be an advocate in the community, particularly among African-American men, and being an advocate of what it means to be a cancer survivor, early detection, and being surrounded by a great team of doctors like at Michigan Medicine can do to help you cross the finish line. I just want to give you a huge shout out on the finish line. I want to thank everyone for standing with me, believing, dreaming, envisioning the potential that we bring in this life.